All right. Today's installment uh, we have is the Arduino Uno. Um, on the bottom there and on top is the uh, Wi-Fi shield. And that um, little red light on the shield indicates that it's uh, currently connected to the network. And um, we can communicate with it um, over HTTP. So uh, next is the little breadboard here, a little piezo element. I've got two LEDs. Um, the red one, which we're going to control using um, an iPhone to turn it on and off. We're also going to be able to play a little tone through the piezo. Uh, what we have here is um, inside here is a um, PIR sensor. So it's a it will detect changes in the infrared. And the reason why I have um, this little dome structure on top of it is just to kind of like narrow its field of vision. So uh, later, if I um, break my hand across it, it should trigger an alarm and then let it the yellow LED. Uh, next, we have a little servo that I can also control. So let's get to it. Um, what I have here is a little uh, iPhone native app I created. So uh, I've got two buttons here to turn on the red LED on and off. So turning it on, turning it off, turning it on, turning it off. Uh, we can play a little uh, a little tone here through the piezo. Okay, pretty interesting. Um, then we have our little servo right here. And um, I created a little, just little slider element here so we can uh, control this guy. So if I turn him a few times, it's kind of cool. Okay. Um, so now uh, for the PIR sensor, right now it's disabled. And what I've done is I've, I have a switch here. And um, it's not kind of out of focus here, but my switch, I've disabled the alarm, um, and then we can go ahead and enable it. So this is sending a command to the board, enabling the alarm. And um, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of um, swipe my hand on top of the little hole there, and it's going to um, trigger basically a little alarm sound uh, coupled with the yellow light. So here we go. Oops. There we go. <clears throat> Yeah. Okay. So it's basically detecting infrared changes if I. Yeah. Pretty cool. Okay. Now, if I want to disable the alarm, I just basically go back here and um, the switch there is on currently. We're going to go ahead and hit it off. I can't do it with my thumb. Okay. And now the uh, alarm should be disabled. So if I basically go over it again, you see there's no noise. So, pretty cool stuff.